Okay, so let's uh, see how to use the crop tool in Photoshop Elements. First I need to open a picture and I'm going to get a sophisticated picture of me. And then I'm going to go over and grab this crop tool, which is this tool that looks like that. And what it does, and it makes it pretty clear once you select, it will highlight what it's going to leave and then it'll throw the rest away. So you've got to be careful with this because um, it will permanently change the original picture so you either want to make another copy of it if you want to keep it and crop that or do a save as after you're done cropping so that it keeps the original picture and the one you cropped. So what I've done is I've selected what I want and notice that I can even once I've selected it I can still move it around what's going to be cropped with the little angles with the little squares around it and I can click on it and move it other places in the picture. But I want to have it right about here now the other thing that's kind of cool is I can tilt this and you can tell it's getting ready to tilt because the arrows make this little circular icon thing and so I'm going to tilt it like this and then what's interesting is it won't actually save the tilted thing it'll make my face tilt you can implement the crop tool by hitting enter or return and then you get this interesting kind of angular face thing which is a kind of stylistic photo that um, I might use on my Facebook page or something I don't know but the uh, um, most important point is you, the way the crop tool works is it selects certain areas and cuts out everything that it doesn't select and you can use that pasted in another graphic if you want or you can just keep it in this graphic etc. In any case that's the crop tool in Adobe Photoshop Elements.